Hey guys, how's it going? My name is Alex and welcome back everybody to Decimation. This is episode 2 and I do not want a Twitch live stream. Okay, never mind. But welcome guys to Decimation. We're here back again in episode 2. And as you can see, we're at the spawn point. Now we're going to run away from all those zombies that you guys can see over there. And we're going to go find an area to just live off of and just kind of find a location. Now obviously this area over here looks infested. So we're probably going to go in this direction here. And see what we can find or run into. But it's going to be pretty cool, guys. Also, I'm sorry about uh, ha not having really a lot of episodes or just videos on the channel for the past uh, few days now. That will be all figured out and sorted and it will be returning. So if you guys can all hit that like button down below, that would be fantastic. Let's see what we can do with that. I'm going to go with my eat chest quickly, get some food. Oh, gosh. No, no. What are you doing here? What are you doing? Back off. Back off. Okay. There is some lag. A bit lag. I don't know why. Okay. This is really bad lag. Jeez, okay. Let's eat some cool ranch. Let's eat some rotten flesh. And okay. Yep, we're about to die. Slash eat chest. Do we have a rag? Uh no we do not. Um we are actually this is actually not good. Okay, whoa. Um slash heal? Is that a thing? Sla okay, what about backpack? Let's drink some water. Maybe that'll be something here. Let's drink some water. Alright, so, uh let's go. Oh, that was one of the issues, I think. Okay, cool. Let's eat some mushroom stew as well. Okay, perfect. So I think we can get some regen going. Alright, guys. That was actually quite intense. Looks like we're regening. We're back to normal. That's pretty cool. By the way, we do have a clan now. So our clan is called the Hilltop. Um, or in general, just Hilltop. Now, that's from The Walking Dead, actually, believe it or not. So that's what we're going to be doing. That's the clan name. Um, we're going to be adding people to the clan as well um, in the future. So that should be pretty cool. And the description of the Hilltop is pretty much, we will survive. So anyone who joins my clan will be a survivor. We're going to survive. And no, no zombie is going to be a threat for us. Well, besides those zombies there. Those zombies had a little threat on us, but we're good now. And uh, it's not going to be like anyone can join the clan. We're going to make sure that, you know, everyone is, is going to be a strong bonded group of people on the server for my clan to represent it. And it's going to be pretty cool. So we're going to make sure that is all intact and there to go. And by the way, Matrix is also playing Decimation as well. So expect him and I to do some interactions as well. And if anything, they will be roleplay based themed on Decimation. So that's going to be really exciting as well. Alright, so that's going to be pretty exciting as well. So Matrix and I will be doing a few things, and we did find a road. Alright, so we're going to we're gonna carry on this road and see what we come across here. Hopefully something good, man. This road, the roads here are actually really beat up, and it's kind of crazy. I do see some, some zombies here. They are strolling around. Alright, let's go see if we can find some homes, some shelter, so we can get some rest. Because, uh, oh, I do see something over there. Okay. This looks like a pretty big fortified place. This looks like someone's base. Actually, no. This looks like a prison of some sorts. All right, we got to watch out for the barbed bar. wire. We're going to get around. Hopefully, no one's here to take us out. But um, let's just slowly go in. Make sure we don't do anything too dangerous here. Okay. It looks kind of clear, to be honest. So we're going to go and check it out. Let's go inside this room here. All right, see if there's any stuff around here, any supplies. Oh, there is. Okay, cool. Red dot site, nacho cheese, and canned limes. Now, I gotta be honest, I don't think I'm gonna be eating that nacho cheese, but uh, I guess we have to eat whatever we can find for supplies, and just so we don't, you know, starve to death. That, that's something we should uh, focus on, make sure we don't starve to death. All right, so let's open this door. Are we stuck in here? There we go. Also, one thing is make sure I bump up the brightness so you guys can see a bit better about what's going on here. All right, there we go. Oh, Remington and some paper. Okay, actually, we do have some Remington ammo, I believe. Uh, let's check out the backpack here. Do we have? Yes, we do. Okay, so that's actually a good thing. We can actually substitute the... Actually, I want to use the axe instead of... I think the axe is just a better weapon, in my opinion. But let's get some ammo up in here loading in the Remington. This thing is probably going to be a big, big, big uh, boost for our survival here because... Let's be honest. It, uh, a shotgun... Oh! I just wasted ammo. Okay, well, at least I know which um, button on the mouse, which click on the mouse uh, fires the gun. So that's actually a good thing. But whatever, if anything, we scared off some people. Hopefully that's that's the case here. Let's put down the brightness just a bit there. There we go, that's better. All right, let's keep looking around. We gotta get as much supplies as possible. We're kind of alone right now. All right, let's see what's in here. Oh, military vest, 
uh, more ammo and a Colt. I don't want the Colt, though. But I think it's time to get the biker jacket off. I mean, guys, I got to be honest. I really do like the way this outfit looks. But I don't know how good the armor is. As you can tell, it's only three bars of armor. However, if we replace it, we have ourselves, you know, just two more extra bars. So... I'm thinking maybe it's the best choice right now. I mean, that doesn't look half bad. We're probably going to go with that. We'll just store the biker uh, gear in our backpack, and we'll just move on and see what else we can find. But I think it's just a better thing to go just for safety purposes. Oh, a C4. More scar ammo. And what is this? A dragon off. Okay, so let's store this in our backpack as well. Um, this is actually pretty decent stuff, so let's do that. Okay, Remington ammo. We don't need the double barrel, and uh, this ammo can be stored. Fuel tank, red dot site could be stored, paper, more ammo, and I think we're okay. We can move on. All right, sweet. Oh, this place is actually broken into. Okay. Um, what's over here? A machete. I will definitely take an extra machete. Um, and then some more food. Definitely can look forward to that. And we got some actual stuff here. We did get C4. Okay, that's good. So let's store this in here. Uh, what do we do need? I don't think we need paper. We don't really need glass bottle. We're going to store the C4. I, I think we have two, so we should throw one away and keep the M16. Now, I don't know if I have ammo for the M16. Oh, we do. Okay, even better. So we're going to actually store the SCAR in here and keep the M16 here. Uh, uh, the M16, sorry. And then the shotgun. I think that's a good call right there. We're going to throw this away. We're going to keep one extra machete. Throw away the bottles. And we should be pretty good. Let's fill this up, though. Let's drink up some water and fill up. There we go. Alright, what's over here? Okay, more water. M116. Well, we needed actually. So we got plenty of ammo to select from there. But I think... Oh! Okay. Uh, gas mask. Drill sergeant hat. I like what we got here though. So I think marine boots was just... What, how, how did... Oh, that looks better. Alright, we're gonna chuck those out. Gas mask. Looks quite intimidating, but... You know, we don't need it right now. We're gonna keep it just in case... But uh, I think that's everything we need. Let's go check out the lookout from here. Okay, is there anything else? You can't really see much from here, to be honest with you. People have been blocking it off, but still, even then, you can't really see much. Um, only from here, really, if you're standing on the stairs. All right, cool. Let's go back down. Man, I could really use some food. All right, we're going to go with the nacho cheese right now and see how that tastes or how much that does for us there. Um, actually, wow, that game gave a lot of saturation. That's kind of interesting. All right, let's keep looking around. So we came from that road. I feel like there could be something. I don't know. There could be something down across this road now that I think about it. All right, you know what? We're going to go to the side of this building here. Now, this is a great area to keep fort for the clan. So I'm going to look forward to possibly doing that. We can get some more supplies here. Oh, okay. I just see one of those guys there. All right, you know what? We're just going to move around here. What do we got here? Oh, okay. This is some good stuff, actually. So I'm going to store that there. I'm going to see what, if there's anything left that's empty because we actually um, just opened it up. There we go. All right. This, okay, now we're attracted. Oh, gosh. That is a freaky looking thing. Oh, what is this, guys? Let's check it out. This looks like it was a military base. Let's read the signs. So United States military zone. So that's why they had all that gear because it's a military zone. But we're going to follow this road and see where it leads to. And I think it'll lead us into a pretty cool area. Now, I think we came this way. So actually, better off, I think it's a good idea maybe to go on the... Uh, I don't know if it's a good idea. Maybe we'll just follow a road along this way if there is another road. There might not be another road around here. But we could go just um, you know parallel to that military base and just go in this direction and see if we can find anything. But it looks like people have been building stuff around here, which is kind of interesting to see. I wonder why that's the case. And it doesn't look like there's been forts, but they look like... They've just been stacking up or something about it. I don't know what that is about. But, um, all right, is this uphill? I don't think we should go uphill. All right, let's drink up some more water here. There we go. Let's get some more food. Mushroom stew. Oh, we are actually getting kind of hungry. There we keep down the radiation. Oh, gosh. What the heck? Oh, that was the rotten flesh. Okay, we got to watch out actually for that. It's not a good idea. All right, all right, all right. My bad, my bad, my bad, my bad. Okay, this is actually intense. Don't eat rotten flesh, guys. Oh, man. Okay, that's some serious... That uh, Okay, that was not good. Alright, let's get the heck out of here. That was... Okay, That do not eat rotten flesh at all. I kind of, for a second, thought it wouldn't do anything. But now we learned, first off, don't do that. Because it would actually really bring down your levels of heart. So that's not good. Um, Alright. 
don't think I see anything else. I feel like this is just going to go uphill, so I'm going to go in this direction and probably bail out on all those zombies coming in from there. So we're going to go here. I really want to use this Remington. Let's actually use this Remington on a few here. So, oh, now it's the zoom in. The shot. Oh, that's not accurate as at all. Oh, my goodness. Okay, so using the Remington, what I learned is do not zoom in. That's everything I learned right there for for those running and want to use the Remington. Do not zoom in or you're going to pretty much waste all the ammo like how I did. I hear gunshots. Oh, we're stuck in a tree. I did hear gunshots though coming around from here. So we're going to go check what that's out. Um, sur surprisingly, we didn't run into the, any survivors, which is weird. Usually we run into a lot of survivors, but hopefully next episode we do run into some survivors. But I do like exploring the woods and going around here and seeing what we can find. Alright, I don't see anything. Hmm. Alright, well you know what, we're gonna go on top of this hill. Take out some of you guys here. Oh, there is food. But I do see snow on top of this mountain. I actually kind of want to check out and see what there is, there is on uh, top of this mountain. There's probably something cool. Maybe. I'm hoping there is. But, you know, if anything, it's a cool hike up. I want to see what it's all about in the snow biome here. Alright. I don't even think zombies will come up this high. I do see wood. I do see clouds up here. Oh, we are really high in the air. We are at high elevation. You can even hear the wind picking up. Alright. Alright. There's nothing up here. Let's whistle a bit. Anyone around? Here's some birds. Nope, I don't think there's anyone around right now. Except for more of these guys. Oh. Nope, that's actually... Maybe it is better to zoom in. I don't know, I'm still kind of learning. I'm, I'm kind of learning along with this uh, Remington, but I do like this gun better, so... As you can see, the M16 is a better gun to go with. Alright guys, I think it's a good idea to keep base on the hilltop. This is kind of a cool idea. This could be the hilltop right here because it's on top of the mountain. There's not many, there's not really much here to fortify besides possibly maybe just putting sandbags around here and a fire camp or whatever. But um, this is a pretty unique area for a possible base for the clan. So I'm probably going to end off today's episode here. It is a shorter episode, but... Um, I'm just looking to see what you guys think about Decimation in general. You know, I'm still testing out the series. I really do want to continue it because one is that I'm potentially going to be meeting up with Matrix here and there and doing some cool roleplay themed things as well on Decimation. And also, it's going to be really cool just to see how the series, um, you know, pans out and with the Crafting Dead as well and the Minecraft Star Let's Play. Don't forget, if you guys want to see more videos on the channel, make sure you guys hit that like button. Make sure you subscribe as well if you're new. And some cool news is Loot Crate and I are going to be working together, so expect some cool Loot Crate deals and promo codes for you guys in the next coming days hopefully i'll get the loot crate for this month um soon rather than later so i can get a video out for you guys on that and this should be pretty cool guys if you enjoyed today's video make sure you hit that like button also if you want to come on this server make sure you go on technic launcher download decimation and come on server number one and this is the un one so peace out guys my name is alex and then stay foxy